What's up? My name's Cameron. Here with Surf Station. Shay, I'm gonna show you how to grip your board. First, you need your grip, your deck, and your scraper. Something sharp you cut your grip with, and then eventually a skate tool. At first, you're gonna wanna make sure your nose and your tail are lined up with the correct side of the grip. And the easy way to just do that is a graphic will normally tell you. This is the nose, this is the tail. Tail is normally smaller than the nose, just by a little bit. If you have a grip with a the design, then uh, just make sure it's facing up the right way. You're gonna wanna start by peeling a couple inches back on your grip, making sure it's all lined up across the board so you don't have to peel it up and restart. Just like that. Keep that around just for later. And you're gonna slowly just start pushing the grip on. Don't worry about the air bubbles, you'll get those down later. Make sure your graphics all good. There you go. And then you're just gonna wanna push it down. Take this, take your uh, the little back sheet of grip, lay it on, and just give it a little roll out. And then also you can just step on your board like this, as so. You want to stomp it out. After your board is all gripped up, you got it all on there, laid down, you're gonna to want to take your scraper and scale the side of the board all the way around, like this. Be careful not to scrape your hand against the grip because that will cut you. And you can use whatever you want to scale the side of your board. I'm just using an old rusty screwdriver. You use whatever you like. You can use your, your truck, your skate tool, or whatever you need. Once your board's all scaled out, it should look a little something like this. You should have the outline of your deck, and you're ready for the next step. The next step, you're gonna go ahead and grab your uh, your sharp blade or your razor, whatever you got. You're gonna grab a little corner of your grip. You're gonna put your uh, blade right up against your deck, and give it a little force, and just push up. And you should have your blade sticking out of the top right there. And once you do, be very careful and just slide it down. Slow and steady so you can have nice smooth cuts. Just give it a little twist. Patience is key. Once you're done, you're gonna wanna just fold it over and make like a little sandpaper type thing. And just scrape the sides of the board so your grip will be nice and uh, flat and even with your deck and will prevent it from peeling up. Today we're going to be switching out my old wheels and my old trucks, putting them on the new deck. And I'm going to show you guys how to do that real quick. You're going to need your skate tool and screwdriver. If you don't have a screwdriver that comes with it, any normal Phillips head screwdriver will do. Righty tidy, lefty loosey, obviously. You just put screwdriver to the bolt, skate tool to, the, to that thing. After you get all the trucks and all the bolts off, properly dispose of this deck. Once you've uh, disassembled your other board, you got rid of that old one, you're gonna wanna get your old hardware. And then just put them in upside down on your board.
Take your old truck and just smash them down. Then you're gonna have them poking through and you're gonna do the same thing on the other side. And once you've poked them all the way through, take them out and put them on the right side of your board as you'd be setting up your chunks. And you're always gonna want your kingpin facing the inside of your board. So that way your trucks will never be on backwards. Take your nuts and your screws and go ahead and start screwing them back on. Once you're done screwing in that last bolt, get rid of your tools, take that chair back, test it out.